Welcome back, Wolfpack. How's everyone doing today? I hope you're all doing fine, just fine. It's I, Strong Wolf 55, the man, the myth, the monster. <coughs> we just built this. Hi, get out of here, Komodo. We just built this crazy train, as you can see over here. We've got our raptor pen set up. These more raptors. Um, we are working on trying to complete this mission, and the only way for us to do it is I have to get a Diplodocious down underneath its comfort threshold for three minutes. And unfortunately, I have five Diplodocious, which means it's a little difficult to find what I have to do. Because I have to find which one that I released when I had this mission is going to be the one that completes the, the, the mission. Boy. All right, so what do we got? 10%, 10% overcrowding. Holy crap. Oh, wait, when did we get 200 million? What happened? What was I, asleep at the wheel? We were making money? Loads of money? Oh, boy. I forgot to adjust all these. Dino onesie. Sixty-nine seems to be the golden price for that. Oh, okay. All right. Okay. Where's the golden range? Sixty-nine again, the golden number. Uh, go fifty-four, fifty-five. That seems to be the peak of that. Yeah, because we're only getting 160. 45. So that, uh, fast food, Dino Bites, Dino Feast. Sell for... All right. Bring in a new manager instead. And the gift shop, night vision goggles, sell for... Fifty-nine. Now the back row is going to lead to a large pen. Okay, let's see. You're not uncomfortable yet. Park management view. Yeah, I think I'm going to want to go feed the dinos. Let's do that. Um, <sighs> oh, now they all show up as uh, being low on food. Looks like I might want to refill everything. Man, these Rexes have not left this one spot so they could fight. <laughs> So much for making them sociable. 
And that's what I did. I have I actually have the social gene on, on them. Uh, from Dr. Wu's DLC. It's what allowed me to stick two of them in the same pen, and they don't kill each other. They just come very near, very, very close to it. Very near to killing each other. Problem is, if one of them does end up killing the other... That's not a dead dino, is it? Oh, it's alive. Ugh. I got nervous there for a moment. You guys duke it out for dominance. Alright, so we gotta get more security bunkers down there. Bathrooms. My double layer raptor pen. Gotta have double layer raptor pen. Otherwise, what what are you doing? Viability's got to go down at some point. <coughs> On viability, there are uh, comfort slowly getting there. It has to drop below forty percent for it to actually uh, do anything. Uh, all right, now I need to get a bathroom in here. All right. Um. Actually, I need. I guess shelter. So why don't I go ahead and do just that? We're gonna and expand by a little bit more. Okay. So we have that. We're gonna get another Hammond Center going in here. We gotta have uh some some stuff for visibility no idea what we're gonna put down here um oh i know exactly what we're gonna put down here herding animals like parasaur and whatnot i don't have that over here we got loads of trikes we got loads of sauropods and rexes with this small population but very large pen that's what I'm going to do. We're going to put an herbivore herd down here. You know, the funny thing is, originally I was going to put Rexes down here. When I was looking at it. But I'm like, ah, oh, we got to start with the Rexes early. Get them up here. And we made a ton of money. So. Right now, we have to. Ham on Santa. Let me get one of these going. <laughs> Perfect. In every conceivable way. All right. Ah, no, it's off and angling. Let's say so overcrowding's at 10%. Uh, still got to have a way of dealing with that. Okay, so what do we what do we got for our ratings? What are we missing? Okay, satisfaction. 
Press room, 62%. Shopping is at 20%. Always at a 20%. Visibility, 81%. What's my transportation rating at? 100%. Operating hotels, 7. Probably need to increase that further. Uh, shelter protection is great. Do want to increase that even further. Um, what kind of things do we have? Jurassic Tours, no. Gyro station requires uh, research. Hmm. All right, now I think I got to double check on enclosures. Right here. Oof, that's going to have to be further out. Much further out. Well, hold on, let's see. The hotels provide some visibility, so that that helps. I'd be able to do away with that road back there, that's for sure. But it wouldn't help me de address the issue of a lack of shelter. Because the shelter... still only covers so much. I mean, ultimately, I'm going to need two in this area, so... Alright. So we're going to put a, a shelter in right here. Kind of a waste, but... We're going to have to position them in different spots. So instead of having great protection, we're going to have full protection. Uh, bathroom. Need to get a bathroom going. I can squeeze those even closer. Which would have made viewing towers. Let's see, even for... Uh, not that not much further. Really? Not much further at all. I think I, I think I'm onto something here. Something pretty ingenious. Just got the word. Doctor Wu has his. Oh, good. Is the test complete. I'm breathing a sigh of relief. Now Doctor Wu's case is elsewhere. I think we should take care of those dinosaurs. Oh. Mm -hmm. Scenery. Comfort. <sighs> Going back up. All right, so now we have three Diplodocus over here. Three down here. Who got a disease? Oh. All right, we're doing all right. Okay, so we completed this mission, which is awesome. Hopefully those specimens aren't too traumatized after this. Thanks for not losing your head back there. This could so easily I mean, that's one way of putting it. Okay, so we have almost hit five stars. We're doing actually pretty well with Dr. Duo. We're halfway through her uh, her mission line. Okay, uh, where do I add from again? Oh yeah, up top. Who, who, who paved these roads?
No, first of all. All right, we're uh, fixing you right up. Don't run too far. Boom, headshot. All right, I don't like what's going on here. Yeah, I noticed. All right, don't have to repair those fences. Don't worry, we'll get more raptors in here too. Because both of these guys, they're like a high population, a high social group. So let's see, what do we got for raptors? You are what, two to six, I think. Uh, yeah, two to six on the social grouping. We only have three of them right now. We'll make more of them. It just helps bring money into the park. Um, actually, we could get some armored dinos in there and have an even bigger mix going on in the pen. big brain moment here so yeah because you can't mix them in just general sizes they have to be certain a certain thing so the large dinosaurs like the rexes the ceratosaurus and whatnot they will go after armored dinos small carnivores won't go after the armored dinos so they can live in the same pen all right so we have um, which, you know, that, that, that works out really well. So I can basically have an armored, uh, armored herbivore, sauropod, and a small carnivore all in the same pen. It'll be just fine. <coughs> See, I like that. All right. So we got to build your road reputation. Let's go. Put, put something under my wheel. No, nothing's under my wheel. All right. I mean, it took us a while to build up to where we were with her. Uh, and now we have to go all the way to get the hair source. All right. So we're, we're going to start putting things, uh, some things on the back burner. Uh oh. All right. We want to hit that five star rating at least once. Once we get that five star rating. So we're here. Coastal. Unlocked with five-star rating. Uh, expedition map. Oh, Ooh. Yeah, because we got new fossils. We can go get... Oh, Dreadnoughtosaurus. That's right. Okay. So we... Need to... Bump up the price a little bit. Oh, no, wait. Do we bump up the price? Which one do we do? I don't even remember. Well, that's okay. All right. Bathrooms. Okay. So I need to work up my relations with security and uh, this guy right here. Most combat victories. So this guy. All right. You want combat victories. We'll do that. I'm going to... Oh, it's got to be out of the way, though. Oh, 
Okay. So we're going to build a bit of an arena pen here. Uh, what I mean by that is we're going to do any combat related shenanigans are going to happen over here. So this has got to be a baryonics. We need a lot of water. We'll remove quite a few of these trees. Oh, we're going to. So we have. Oh, we got we got a lot of things we got to be doing. Um, we're going to be working on. Like I said, getting a baryonics up. Well, what we're going to do with Ceratosaurus, we're probably just going to release it as normal. As normal as possible. Modifying its genome. I know we made it pretty far. Um, Alright, up your attack by to 134. Up your defense to 63. Hmm. We get the we get the defense to 63 with aggressive instincts anyways. So why don't we do that? Aggressive instincts. We could raise this thing's defense all the way up to 74. Ooh. <laughs> It'll have really low resilience, though. So let's see what Ceratosaurus. Well, this thing actually has a pretty high attack. All right, but when we remove all of that, it still has an 85 attack. That's not bad. At Baryonyx, we've gotten him. To have a 63 defense, which is pretty, pretty valuable. You have a 123 attack. We could just crank that way up. But why don't we... Yeah, why don't we add to your defense? Hmm. Hyper-efficient blood. The difference, so, is that resilience, and I know I'm going to have to keep checking up on this guy for disease, so, whatever, we'll just go with it. It's brain aging. So, not only am I almost guaranteed to get him, uh, he's going to have a very high attack and very high defense. Um, so, we're going to incubate one of you, and we're going to incubate one of you, and... And all that water feeder. We'll drop down two meat feeders. Set them both to 45 minutes. Should be fine. All right, so we're going to get back to that when we uh, get a chance. Um, so what do we have here? We got two more raptors, so we have a total of five raptors. So much more sociable raptors. I like how... The Hammond Center 
is playing the creepy music. Okay, so... Alright, I still have to develop this over here. Oh, wait, we got... What? What's our power? Oh, we need upgrades in you. Upgrade... Outage protection and improved output. I'm gonna get those on all of them. My favorite combo. Don't have to worry about power outages. <laughs> it's just smart. Oh, all right, we got that, and we have that. Okay, so these... I mean, this area is pretty popular. So we are still at just about four and a half stars. Wastage, usage... <coughs> okay, capacity. Okay, capacity. What's my capacity at? So what would happen if I put a hotel here? I mean, arguably, it resolves a lot of issues with occupancy, putting in the two more. All right, so these guys aren't going to have necessarily much of a view, but they, they exist. And they exist near the tram. Mm, makes me wish I put a cut through spot here. <laughs> Hindsight! But over park, park overcrowding is down to 5%. We are just over 4.5%. This has been one of the hardest islands I've had to hit that fifth star. But it seems this is the way to go. All right, so we have that. All right, so three, so we have eight dinos in there already. Let's find an armored dino that can deal with a higher population. That's just pretty much what it comes down to. Which one will tolerate more dinosaurs in their pen? Population eight. Mm, that's that's not good. Um, is this armored? Info. Armored. Yeah, they're armored. Chunkingosaurus. Modified genome. What's your social at? Um, two to eighteen. I could potentially use these guys. All right, actually, did did I modify this guy at all? All right, let's see what we have here. Okay, we'll go with aggress uh, aggressive instincts. Viability, we're at a 13% viability. Oh, that's why we had a lifespan of 150. Yeah, this, these guys are fine. All right. Who else do we have for armored dinos? All species we already have available. Armored herbivore. Rating is at 58. 83. Uh, I'm going to go with these guys because these guys um, will handle pop total population of up to 18, which means I can increase the number of Diplodocus I have in there. <coughs> so it should be fine. We'll find out if uh, I messed up, you know, in a bit when uh, th th they get released. Because if the kids are not all right, well then. All right. 45 minutes. Ooh. 45 minutes. You guys are doing all right. 
45 minutes should be fine. Nice. All right, so I'm looking to increase the stars again. Oof, we just went down a little bit. We're still at that four and a half mark. Okay, increase staff. That's the general idea. Okay, boom. Yeah, you're going to need more staff. Yeah, sure. Why not? One place being overmanaged for a little bit isn't going to be that big of a deal. Because this place is also going to fill up. We're at overcrowding of 5%. So, I think I'm doing all right. We have nine hotels. Yeah, we're going to have to put more than that. It's like a little resort city. Okay, so these guys both made it. Awesome. 72% chance. You fail at the last second. Don't you let me down. All right. So the armor dino should be just fine. Let's hope. Let's wait and see. Okay, cool. His social's gonna go up. Uh, speaking of dinos, we're gonna have fighting. What? The Barry died. Come on. <laughs> I need you to live. Uh... All right, so we're right now trying to figure out this pen down here. I mean, it shouldn't be that bad. A lot of these guys are going to be like Gallimimus, Streusiomimus. Um, we're going to build upon having a higher dinosaur rating, which is uh, including unique species. We add to that. That helps that overall. Helps improve everything over here. Okay, satisfaction. Shopping is low. Restrooms are higher. Fun. It's a lot of this back and forth stuff. That... The, the shaping of, like, this map having... <gasps> no! Oh, no! You know, I should probably see how many I can have. I already have what? Uh, ideal grouping. Social group 2 to 12. They can have up to 18. We have 8 in there already. I'll do 5. Okay. So this area is going to be tricky. Nope. Oh. Success rate. Success rate. Success rate. Ooh. What's going on? Right. Boom. 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 Yeah, that's going to look ugly. I did the same thing! Closures, right here. Now, I, I had uh, presented this before. It wasn't quite working out right. Oh, there we go. Dinosaur is ready to release. Nice. And they all live together quite harmoniously. Small carnivores to armored. Fine. Oh, you're almost ready. All right, I'm going to go get some water. All right, and we're back. And something is missing power. Who doesn't have power? Oh, here we go. Oh, yeah, the real issue was the fencing. Really? You can't have a walk path go under the... 
That seems a bit arbitrarily uh, restrictive. All right. <laughs> I don't make the mechanics here. So there's a very long walkway to get to this, but that's all right. Here we go. Mm. Yeah, that, that that's not going to fit. <laughs> I pretty much made sure of that. All right. All right. I know. Very, very quiet. Just kind of focusing. Get this uh, stuff done. And there comes the monorail. Well, could I cover this all? Oh. Hundred percent covered. Okay, now we just get some roads here. Let's see. Boom. Boom. Done. Okay. Uh power. There we go. And another restroom. Let's if we can squeeze it on the other side here. Yes, we can. Now we're going to need plenty of water. There should be plenty of grasslands in there. All right. Let's 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 see if we can... Yeah, we'll just kind of do some cheeky expansion over here. I mean, really. No point in keeping all of that so open and unused. There we go. Uh, feeders. We're going to need plant-based feeders. I'm planning on a fair amount of dinos in here. Okay, let's... 45. 45. 45. 45. 45. 45. 45. Alright. Let's start with Parasaur. Uh, see, uh, these guys, 2 to 24, ideal population. You can easily make that work. Edmontosaurus, 1 to 25. So we have uh, Corythosaurus, Edmontosaurus. Those two are going in there, definitely. Uh, I could stick a few Diplodocious, but we already have that in there. Social grouping, we dropped this down because it requires so many. Oleoro Titan. That's a, that's a good one right there. One to one to twenty. Oh, geez, no, 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 cancel. We're gonna toy with your genome, and then we're just gonna learn about you that way. Social, mm, ideal population four to twenty-three. So I can pick five dinos. 22. And we could really put in like, yeah, five different dinos. We could put four of them in there. You would require a minimum of four. Same thing with you. Oh, geez. I'm going to have to put them all on the loader uh, thing. What 
about this guy? Zerg 23, 3 himself. Looks like a carnivore. Hmm. So we're looking at. Alright, what do we got? Eddie Boy should be pretty low. Gallimimus, what's your ideal grouping? This guy's probably also a lot, too. 23. Alright, so Parasaur, let's modify these guys. We already have them at a... They're sitting at a viability of, what? 12%. Gonna have to make some modifications here. Uh, social. Loner two. Loner two. Viability drops down to minus eight percent. That's that's a fifty-two percent chance of popping out a parasaur. I mean, I kind of do want to keep their rating pretty high. I could always... It's just three points of rating, but I lose, what? 5% of... Only 5% viability, really? Requires higher comfort threshold. These guys are pretty easy going. I like them like that. So we're going to leave them like, like this. Hello. I lose four points. But we gain well, four points of rating, but we gain a bunch of a bunch of viability. Uh, I'll keep them as is. Goal is we got to get two of these guys out there. Social grouping is one, four, but if we get at least two. We should be fine. Got it. All right. Well, those are being done. Up to 6% overcrowding with everything we have. Ouch. Ouch. Alright. And here's a moment we've all been waiting for. We're going to release the Barry. I like how he's got like that crocodile skin all down his back. Alright. Alright. So he's all good to go. So this guy. Ceratosaurus. And now, the moment I've been waiting for. I gotta assist in this apparently. We gotta go patch him up. Get out of the way! Alright. We got the uh, reputation reward now. Or the um, reputation, uh, reputation mission. Okay, so now. 
What happened? <gasps> Research Aggressive Instincts 2.0. Hell yeah. <laughs> Okay, round two. I'm gonna do that for the uh, combat. Oh, totally. We need to research genetic modifications. We're looking for genes that can have an impact on the dinosaur's specific traits. Mm -hmm. Their aggression, attack rating, and so on. And Dr. Dewitt need not know anything about this. This is a point I don't want to have to repeat. Copy that. Oh. <laughs> receive word the research is complete, and we can proceed with genetic mods to the animals. Do I really not have a research center? aggressive behavior. What are, you, what are you gonna do to these dinosaurs? I seriously hope that you know what you're doing because I know, I know, and I survived it. It's something that you cannot yet say. Dinosaur is ready to release. All right. Oh, not that one. Mm. Alright, so we got a, we got ourselves a pretty sweet park setup going on. Wait, what what? Oh Oh, come on. Be a pal. Oh wait, wait, wait. I only need one of them at a time. So this is one of four. We're gonna get another parasaur going. All right, tell me. The only thing it doesn't like this place is not populated. Okay, so we're gonna work on getting that population up. Hmm. How modified is this thing? All right. So you're not a very big kid, so we don't need you to take a very big kid. Whoa. I got to go deal with that. Right. Oh no. It's spreading. Oh boy. It's a good thing the parasaur's quarantine, am I right? Eh, we're gonna have to check on the feeders later. Your feeders are starting to run low. Wait, what? Oh, wrong pen! Oh, no, 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 no. Where'd you go? Drive. Crap, I'm in the wrong pen! Oh, 
Oh, then I'm gonna have to feed these guys. Ooh. Oh no! Oh, this parasaur is gonna murder all of my dinos. Oh god, I just released it. It got it gets a disease. Whoa, that's not good. Oh, now we're up to three. <sighs> Crap, you got to go back to base. You. Cure this guy. <coughs> Jeez, they're both in that pen. Alright. He's just gonna get to the parasaur. Oh, come on. it stopping don't run don't run come on oh this is what I had to do with the last time wait wait you're not the one who's sick Please stop body blocking! Oh my god! Oh no no, this is exactly what I- mm. Wait, where are the other ones? Oh, come on. It's a dangerous world, and this place makes it more dangerous. <laughs> Working on it! Oh, no, 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 no. I mean, it looks like they're dealing with the disease on their own, but like... So they're both in here this time. That parasaur is probably going nuts. All by itself. See, this is what happens when you go and you get yourself diseased. I can't get you new buddies. Oh. Oof. 
That pen is no good. I know, you're, you're, you're attacking a jeep in there. It's fine, it's fine. Oh. See, they escaped. I gotta be careful in this pen, though. I might not escape. Let's see. All these were recently filled. All right. Troll room. All right. So we got him a buddy, and we got him. An we got another buddy coming along. I need to hurry up. All right, population is up. <coughs> All right, hatching bay. We're going to do another one of these guys. That helps that helps some. Not enough. Hopefully it slows things down a bit. Hmm. I think, yeah, we already gave the social down. Yeah, we're going to make you even... A little more antisocial. All right. I gotta get gotta get those guys out and released fast. Hmm. But so far, our rating is improving. We haven't hit that five star yet. That's frustrating. But we are getting there. No. You, you had you had like <coughs> you have what? You have a nine percent chance of dying. No, oh no, sorry, nineteen percent. Never mind, I read that wrong. I'm a dumb. All right, but I'm looking at the time, and well, let's just see the moment you've you've really been waiting for here. Yeah, and now we're going to get this entertainment one. We're getting loyalty bonus. That's not good. Ooh. But I'm almost done all of its unlocks. So that would be good. All right, I'm going to get my vehicle now. I know there was a fight. I set it up. So this is our little experimental pen. We're gonna do some, some of the. Uh, ooh. This wants me to assist, so. Alright, 
Excuse me. <laughs> Thank you. All right. Well, now that that's over with. Our existence is the constant evaluation of threats and opportunities. No, you're only giving me plus, uh, pretty much the same up, same down. If it's not increasing by that extra one, it's not worth it. Because <coughs> then I'm, I'm just not making any progress towards keeping all the, uh, reputation high. We're going to add task. All right. Hmm. Yeah, time to time to put you down. Time to sell you. Ugh. And now we got to start working on a Rex with 184 attack. All right. Do we have aggressive instincts too yet? Oh, we do. Hmm. 184 attack. Is that even possible? All right. All right, so 153. Oh, no, 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 no. Hmm. 183. Oh. Oh no. Oh no. All right. Um. Oh, social. It's got to be one, one spot. Oh, there's 187 I can hit. Oh, I missed that. <coughs> all right, all right. So we'll get you brewing. All right, time to sell my uh, baryonics. Yeah. Okay. Oh, 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 oh. No. Why did you die? I think... Hoping we hit that minimum. All right, everyone, comfort 100%. Comfort 100%. Where's the other one? Were you testing the fences? I think he was. 
All right. We hit the bare minimum. They're happy now. They're happy. They're happy. But hey, <coughs> I think it's a good time to leave it here. Or Leo Titan. All right, so we got the other one in there. Mm. There. All right. Well, I'm looking at the time as far as the video is concerned. That's going to do it for me. We're going to leave it here. Um, I want to thank everyone for watching. Be sure to uh, like, comment, and subscribe. Don't forget to check me out on Twitch and follow me on Twitter, uh, especially if you want updates or notifications when videos are going to be coming out, things like that and whatnot. Anyways, that's going to do it for me. I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.